What's up, y'all? Welcome to another wonderful episode of The Artist Alcove. I'm your host, Ari Buddy, but there's nobody joining me on the Green Velvet Couch this week. And that's because we're going to take you behind the scenes to see just what all makes up the set. The box is very random, but I promise you, this set is not. Everything is here with addition. Some things have beautiful stories that go along with them. But we're going to take you back on each of these shelves, on each of these racks, and show you all of the wonderful things that are going on so that you feel like you're a part of the show and the set for our next episode. Let's get started. Let's start with our wonderful set. This set was hand done, y'all. On top of being a 24-7 artist and entrepreneur, I also have one of those lovely nine to fives that sometimes turn into eight to eights. And so this beautiful mural was hand drawn a pencil, then completely taped out and hand painted, y'all. It took two weeks, but it was made with care and love. And hopefully you can see that in all of the beautiful colors and textures that were created. So with the set comes set components, right? So let's dive into just what's all on these walls at the Artist Alco, shall we? First up on our right side wall, we've got a lovely piece called Shade. This piece right here is one of my favorite pieces from my debut art collection, Clear Appreciation Month. Check that out on my website and my Instagram. You're also going to be learning a lot about this exhibit and these pieces in detail so you understand just what these pieces mean. Awesome. We got that. And we come up to our first shelf here. Got our lovely Princess Di there, you know. Shout out to Princess Diana, you know, giving a little charm, a little love. Got our beloved Francis here, you know, baby bunny on the bottom there. Giving a little love, spreading some joy. We've got some greenery. We've got the two animals that really make up my soul here. We've got the little dolphin and, of course, my favorite, the sloth. Lovely rose quartz to bring love, some fluoride, some blue agate to bring in good energy and tranquility. And, of course, we have the branded logo here just bringing in some vibes we've got some old film from one of my great grandpas as well as a mug that represents his love for photography so this is like a, a family little shelf you know goodness and health and wellness trinkets from good old francis back there we love francis shout out to francis r.i.p let me go over here to the fun corner we've got a lovely drag hook and yes Mother Rue would approve. I did make this. And um, we have some pillar work and of course the most lovely candle that I put together from an antique piece. Isn't it pretty? With more and more agate and rose quartz because we want the love. A little fluoride right there. We want the love. We want the tranquility. We also have a lovely little piece of Costa Rica right here. You know, straight off the beach, cleansed and ready for the show. Awesome. Another dolphin. Gotta love the consistency. Got some lovely pictures here. Gotta have the dream catcher. You cannot go without the dream catcher. Get all that bad juju with that here. Got our color. And of course, we have Rue references for days. This lovely gem came from our very own David Farina. Go check him out in episode four. RuPaul's Dragon Race. Hilarious. The best. He hand drew and hand stoned this lovely piece for our set, and we love it, and Mama loves it. We know that for a fact. Let me go on our left wall. Left walls got all the crazy in all the good ways. Of course, we got our lovely bunny. Gotta have bunny. And on this side, we have the logo that's actually for my business where I make custom pieces. So we don't want to keep those separate so people know that's more of the modern contemporary style. And then of course, for some of you, you may not understand this. You may think, oh, see you next Tuesday. What on earth, everybody? But it's actually a 
all reference, charisma, uniqueness, nerve, and talent. And so you all want a little bit of see you next Tuesday. Trust me, because everybody needs that. And of course, the people who brought us here, the people who make it happen, the brand that represents all the artists who want to be themselves, pack a label logo in full effect. Then we have the lovely exploration shelf. And it's the exploration shelf because there are components here from around the world. We've got a lovely kitty straight from the mainland, you know, China. More rose quartz, more agate. And of course, we have this beautiful little elephant. It's so cute from Thailand. You know, bringing in those cultural vibes, bringing in those open minds. Check this out. You remember this? That's right. Another David Farino. He's just all over the set, man. He's all over the set. We've got OJ's White Bronco on the set, you know, for fun vibes. It's totally not. It's, it, I mean, maybe it is. We don't know. Sage. Look at this lovely bit from Mexico. We love that. Shout out. We have a beautiful friend who provided this, and it just really makes the set. We've got a little culture here. Got some amethyst. Gotta have a sage. You just gotta have a sage. We got some island vibes, you know. Keep it iry, keep it fresh. And we got Buddha because Buddha is the example of peace, and we want peace here. That's what we want. That's what we need. Another beautiful little antique. Shout out to the Disney kids, a little Aladdin for you. When we come over here, look at this big, beautiful Himalayan salt piece. Gotta love it. Carrying your love with me, a beautiful trinket that I received from a beautiful soul that contains, let's look inside, what's inside, what's inside? Oh yeah. The people who watch over me and make everything possible. Shout out to the greats and the great greats. They love that. And of course, we had to have a little alien on the set. I mean, come on, Bunny's an alien. A sweet friend also gave me this little piece, had to be on the set. Got another Buddha reference, holding up that rose quartz. We got everything we need, man. We've got all the components for love, positivity, for good energy, for all the things. You'll also notice every episode that I'm wearing my handy dandy uniform. Got to keep it fresh by going to aribunny.com and getting yourself some merch. See if there's any bunnies left. There'll be more bunnies to come. Got some cool sweatshirts. Check it out. Be a part of the set. Be a part of the show. And get ready for another episode of The Artist Alcove. Because it's coming to you. I promise. Like, tomorrow. Like, you don't really have that much time to lag. So just get ready. Because it's coming. So that's the set, y'all. I hope you enjoyed this quick little behind the scenes sneak to see all of the wonderful components that make our set our set. And I hope that you enjoyed a little bit of what makes each component special. We're almost through the season, y'all. Halfway mark. Episode 6 is coming tomorrow. Don't miss it. Get ready for more fun. We're almost to 10. Can you believe it? 10, 10, 10. We're almost there. We're going to have a lot of fun getting there. And we can't wait to see you. But until then. I'm our buddy. Peace.